Hey y'all, welcome back to Adventuring with Amanda. Thank you so much for being here. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Happy Christmas Eve. Happy, or I guess it'd be Merry Christmas. It's weird because it's like Christmas Eve, it's like Merry Christmas Eve, but like Merry Christmas, Happy Christmas Eve. Okay, uh, these are things that Amanda thinks. <clears throat> Happy Christmas Eve. Merry early Christmas. Let's go with that. <laughs> y'all, I'm a mess. Um, okay, so... Christmas is tomorrow. I am ready. I got my tree lit. I cannot believe I didn't think sooner to put the fairy lights in my little Christmas tree. Oh, it's looking so cute. I'm excited. I'm actually going to have it out at the potluck tomorrow. I am headed back to Quartzsite for Christmas. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to be spending this holiday with my Quartzsite family and Maddie. We are going to have so much fun. I am cooking a whole bunch of stuffing, my mom's homemade recipe to bring tomorrow, and I have everything ready. So tomorrow morning, I will be essentially cooking at my house, uh, and then I have like these disposable pans that I'm going to bring all the stuffing in because we have a couple of ovens to use at La Posa South at our campsite. So I will warm it all up um, once I get there, but it's going to be super fun. I'm really excited about it. I'm going to take a video so um, you can kind of see what we do for our potluck tomorrow. It's going to be a blast. And also in this video, I just kind of wanted to show you a couple more things in my van small changes that I made and kind of how I'm getting ready for Quartzsite this week. I will pretty much spend the week out there. I'll probably be there like Sunday through Thursday this week. The weather is going to be phenomenal. And yes, I'm bragging. Yes, I'm bragging. It's going to be 72 tomorrow for Christmas and sunny. Literally the lows at night are going to be around 50 degrees. So, <sighs> yay. <laughs> I'm not going to need like all of my blankets and my cold weather sleeping gear, which I am stoked about. 70 degrees with like 45 to 50 at night is quite literally optimal sleeping weather for yours truly. So let's jump into what's popping around the van so you can see kind of what I will be up to in the week to come. And of course, I'll be uploading videos every single day, so I'm taking y'all with me. Let's get started. Please take a second to appreciate how pretty my tree is. Look at it. Oh my goodness. It's so beautiful. I'm just bummed I didn't put my lights on it sooner, but that's okay. I'll enjoy it this week. And now I know for next year. <laughs> I have my little, my gold tinsel on there from the dollar store and my fairy lights now, so... It looks so pretty and I will take it out at camp tomorrow so I can share the joy with everybody. I have my new blanket down that my mom got for me. So I love that it adds a pop of color to my van. You know, I'm so used to the gray and the teal. Y'all know how much I love those colors, but I'm really excited to just bring a little more into my van. So I will be using that and you know what? I'm going to back to my blue toilet for a little bit to kind of see because to be honest with you, it's a little bit lower, shorter. It's easier to bag and I like the shape better, I think, than my black one. So, and then like for a lid, I use like an absorbent towel on the top. And so, I don't know, I'm going to go back to this this week and kind of decide what I want to do but I also have my black toilet collapsed in my rooftop box so I do have that um, as you know another option if I need it and then I also have my wood table sitting right there now because with my new storage tote in my trunk the wood table doesn't really fit and I don't want to put it in my rooftop box but it works out well right there and it doesn't take up any additional space so I think that'll be just fine. I also have some extras that I am bringing with me on this trip. So this is actually a new portable power station, but it's not mine. It's actually Maddie's. I had him send it to my house 
uh, because the company didn't want to send it to a box in Quartzsite. So I was like, just send it to my house and I'll bring it to you. And that worked out way better because I just feel like it's safer. So um, I will be bringing that to him. And then that bag is for him as well. Let me get my scrunchie. And so I have stuff to bring to him. And let's go take a look at the trunk. I don't know why it took me so long to do this, but I hung up my paper towels using a bungee cord and stuck them, stuck it on my shelf. Um, excuse me, Amanda, why didn't you think of this sooner? Well, I don't know. So there's that. I have my Legos that my brother got me for Christmas. So I'll be bringing my Haunted Mansion Legos to work on in Quartzsite. And I think what I'm going to do is when I'm done with the lights from my tree, I'm going to take off the fairy lights and I'm, <laughs> I'm going to use them on my Legos. It's going to be dope. I also put my toaster oven in my tote here and moved some things around. So as you can see, I don't have the wooden table back here anymore. It is sitting on the floor where I showed you. Additionally, I have my little portable bonfire here. Okay, I'm not gonna take it out because it's like in a perfect space. But I have my portable bonfire right there that I'm going to try out this week as well. So I packed that up. Just one, uh, my mom got me two, but I just put one in here because it lasts three to five hours and I can't, ha I can't imagine like having it lit for five hours in one day. So I'm gonna bring it this week, see how that goes. And, oh, I also, behind my water here, so down, you can kind of see it. My sink is down on the floor there, and I also packed a baking sheet. So my baking sheet I will be using with my toaster oven, and I also have an extension cord with a surge protector that I'll be using with my Van Powers power station so I can plug in my toaster oven without any issues because the cord is so short. I stocked up on my Kuju coffee, made sure I brought two boxes. I've been kind of drinking a lot of it in Quartzsite lately, so I brought my two boxes. I also filled my white bags, so those are good to go. And I think that's mostly it. I just, I even have my clothes packed already, so the only thing I need to pack tomorrow is the food in my fridge, as well as the stuffing, and then I am all set. One other thing I did was I adjusted my back windshield heat shield covering. I noticed that on this side, there was like a little bit of light coming through. So I just took it down real quick and re-suctioned it up there. So it is nice and straight now and no light should be coming through my trunk. All right, y'all, that is going to do it for today, this Christmas Eve. I am all set for La Posa South tomorrow to spend it with my Quartzsite family. I, will hope, I hope that you will join me and Winston in our content this upcoming week, and I hope you all have a very safe, happy, and healthy Christmas day tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. I will see you next time.